onto the floor on all fours. We're gonna start in boat dog, just 20 seconds hold each side. And I want you to think about squaring your body down to the floor. Exhale, lengthen. Just stay here for me. Think about keeping that rib cage in, stabilizing your body, and keep breathing out. See if you can hold that brace. So that lift, closing your hips, everything I just said about that, about your core in the beginning. Stay here, change side. Try not to rock in the mirror, in the mirror, in the middle. Stay there, lengthen away, exhale. Keep your rib cage down. I'm gonna do a lot of talking, all right? Using your breath. Five, four, three, two, one. Change side, lengthen away. Now you're gonna tap your thigh. Do not move your midsection. Exhale as you close. Inhale, lengthen. I want you to count five more. Four. Keep your body still. Three. Two. Can you give me that last one? Hold it out now. Stay there. Hold. Nice and strong. Keep your rib cage in. Exhale. Whether you're holding baby, you're holding your core. Last five, four, three, two, one. Release down, change sides, lengthen, now tap that thigh. Keep your midsection still. Think about lifting from your thigh, keeping that rib cage in. Now I want you to give me five more. Once you've done those five, hold out for me. Stay there and hold. Lengthening rather than height. Keep that rib cage. Keep lifting in the middle. Keep breathing out. Can you grab your pelvic floor? Can you hold your pelvic floor? Five, four, three, two, one. Relax down. Bring your body to me. You're gonna rotate round. Evenly distribute your weight between your knee and your hand. Lift that one up, and then we're gonna lift that leg. Lift and lower. Just try and stay with me. Doesn't matter how high you come, I don't want any pain. So it might go a little lower, you decide. But keep your tempo with me, because I'm actually counting rounds. Lift it up. Find that breath, exhale. Let's go for eight more. Seven, go on. Six, five, four, lift it up. Three, two, that last one, hold. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, one, release down, change side. It's a little burner, isn't it? <laughs> Lift it up. Square yourself to me. Lift, push through your heel. Exhale. Come on, keep that effort. Strong in that upper body. We're gently toning that upper body as well. about that breath. Give me eight more. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Last one. Hold. Stay there. Hold. Four. Heading on to all fours. You're gonna extend that back leg. Now you can either keep that back leg to the floor or you can lift it up. You're gonna extend through. 
through. If you've done my Pilates, you're gonna know what we're gonna do. We're gonna tuck it under, so we're gonna thread the needle. Do not touch the floor. Stay there for four, three, two, one. Reach back to me. Give me your core. Give me that balance. If your balance is all over the place, just drop that back foot to the floor. Four, three, two, one. Reach back to me. We're gonna do five each side. So this is number three. Tuck it under. Stay there. Four, three, two, one. Reach yourself. Good, last two, tuck. Four, three, two, one. Reach to me. Give me that last one, tuck. Four, three, two, one. Reach to me. Release down. Change side. Back leg up or down, you decide. Reach to me. Lift it off the floor, tuck yourself through, stay there and hold for four, three, two, one. Remember you are not touching that floor. Exhale, tuck. Four, three, two, one. Reach back to me. Good, stabilize your body. Four, three, two, one. Reach back. Go on, exhale, tuck it under. Four, three, two, one. Be strong in that supporting arm. Give me that last one, tuck. Four, three, two, one. Lift it up. And release down. Now we're heading on to our back. Prenatal. Put two cushions behind your back, okay? Two cushions. Roll to your side, then roll to your back. Pre and pose. From here, I just want you to just massage your lower back. Tuck your bottom under, so you're lengthening your spine and press your back gently into the floor. Now you're gonna relax everything. And again, tuck under, press. And relax everything. From here, Nice and strong in those legs. Maybe you'll be able to touch your uh, heels. Maybe not. But bring those legs in close to you. Exhale, drive. Now when you come to that top, prenatal, remember you've got those two cushions behind your back. So you're on like a bit of an incline. Stay here for me. Find your breath. Close from every direction. Inhale, down. Relax everything. Exhale up. Inhale down. Exhale up. Inhale down. Think about what I said in the beginning. We're trying to close those hips and zip. Inhale down. Exhale, squeeze. Inhale down. When you inhale down, you relax. Be in control of your body. Inhale down. Exhale. Inhale. We're going to stay here for another 30 seconds. Inhale down. Can you really switch off at the bottom? So relax everything, every bit of tension. Exhale, drive. Really use that breath. Give me five seconds. So maybe just that last one. Release down. We're heading into a single leg glute bridge. So we're gonna take ourselves over, find yourself um, in the middle. And then when you lift up, lift as high as you can. Now you might really struggle with this, so it might just be small. And down, exhale. Go on, really squeeze, be strong in that single-sided leg. Single-sided movement, beautiful way to train. Exhale, squeeze. As soon as you leave the floor, I want you pushing up with that one leg. Give me five more on this side. 
Last four. Three. Four, two more. Exhale. Give me that last one. Squeeze. Release down, change sides, straight in. Remember, you might not come as high. Push your shoulders into the floor. So you're creating that tension in your upper body as well. Make it our back one. Squeeze, exhale. As soon as you leave that floor, get that other leg up. Five more. Last four. Three, you got it. Squeeze. Two. That last one. Lift it up. Go on, lift. Lower down. Massage that lower back. Make sure you got those cushions still prenatal. Keep hold of it anytime we're lying on our back after 16 weeks. Just prop that upper body up a little bit. Bring those legs in. Now from here, you're gonna square your hips. You can even bring your arms up as well. I've got full on sunshine in my face. It feels really nice there actually. You're gonna tap down, exhale up. Now I want you to deflate like you're doing that top button on the tightest pair of jeans that you own. I mean, does anyone wear jeans anymore? <laughs> I haven't been in a pair of jeans for so long. Exhale. Deflate. Take your time. We're gonna be here for 45 seconds. This is because I want you to encourage going at a slower pace to really wrap your abdomen. Exhale. Come on, keep this. Think about lifting from your thighs. Exhale. Last 10 seconds here. Last one, go on there. Hold those legs in, you're gonna open, and you're gonna exhale, close, deflate. Inhale, exhale. Imagine you have a spring in the middle of your thighs. Think about shrinking, shortening, top to bottom, back to front. Tighten in that midsection, even in prenatal. Exhale. Twenty seconds. Go on, squeeze. The more you use your breath, the more we're gonna work it. Last one, exhale.